Hey guys, what's up? I'm Justin. Welcome to another episode of Real Life TV. Today I'm going to teach you about alternative ways to swear in English. So stay tuned. Okay, so the first way that we actually use it to write is this symbol here. And this symbol represents when we say the word there's a bleep. That's bleep. So then we have the word fuck, which is also called the F word. So the way we use this, if you get upset and you have to yell fuck, you might say fudge, you might say frick. And if you use it as an adverb, for example, I'm fucking tired, you might say, like, I'm freaking tired, I'm freaking tired, I'm effing tired, I'm flipping tired. And then the final way that we use this is when we say, you might say WTF, which you see on the internet all the time, that's what the fuck, you might say, what the bleep. The next swear word that we are going to teach an alternative for is the word shit. So you don't have to say shit, you can say shoot, you can say shiznit, these are way less offensive. The next word is hell. We use the word heck instead of hell. So for example, instead of saying like hell yeah, you can say heck yeah. Instead of saying what the hell, you can say what the heck. The next word is ass. Ass is a little bit offensive, but you don't have to use it. You can say arse, you can say butt, you can say bum. The next curse word that we often use is damn, like damn. Like, that's damn good. You can actually say darn. You can say dang. You can say doggone. The next word is bitch. So you can, you can use a couple alternatives to bitch. First of all, it's more of a gangster term coined by Dr. Dre. This is not something you want to use in a normal situation because it's something you want to play with, actually. But biatch, the next one, you might say son of a bitch is the bad word, but you can say son of a gun. That's not offensive at all. Okay, now moving on to the religious swear words. So, God is actually not very good to use as a, as a swear word. You don't want to use this as like an exclamation. So you might say, gosh, gosh, instead of God. My gosh, or my goodness. And then sometimes people say like, Jesus, when they're really frustrated about something, or some, they're amazed by something, but you can say, geez. And then the final one, some people say, Holy shit. So holy is obviously something that's very like religious, very sacred. So you can say, holy cow. So that does it for today. Alternatives to swear words. Remember, be careful using these. Play around with them. Pay attention to the media. I really, really recommend caution with these because it's still much more complicated than just using these words. But I hope you enjoyed the lesson today. If you want to get more videos like this one, Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, or you can subscribe to our mailing list where you get a free copy of 101 Words You Won't Learn at School. Take care.